This is Accounting on Excel with Amaka Ifebonando. In today's lesson, we'll be looking at how to convert Excel to PDF. So we're converting an Excel file to PDF. Basically, it's an Excel sheet, not the entire workbook. And uh, to do that, we'll be using uh, invoice, invoice workbook to do that. So I'll just slide into my invoice workbook to do that. This uh, the my invoice uh, template, which I use in tracking sales. So I have details of a client. All I need to do is just to create it in a PDF format and send it across to him. It's quite professional doing that. As a business owner, it's quite professional. So to do that, you just go to your file, click on file, then click on save and send, save and send. When you click on the save and send, you will see other options. You can send using an email, save to web, but what we are interested in is to create a PDF. So you click on that. Then you come and click on this option. Now we want to create a PDF. Uh, first of all, it has already saved it as a PDF type. The only thing I will do is just to edit. If I don't want this name, I may just use uh, customer 001. Let me just use it as customer 005. And just leave it at that. So out, I'm telling the open immediately after publishing. All right. You can also check out other option. Yes, all pages in this worksheet, then the active worksheet. So you ensure that it's the active one, unless you want to in, um, print, uh, convert the entire workbook. Well, I just want the active worksheet. That's why it's selected and all the pages. But if you want some pages within the active worksheet, you select this option. I want all pages and I want the active worksheet. So I will just click on OK. When I'm done, I click on Publish, right? Good. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is it. How do you see that? Let me just reduce the zoom to 100. Well, can you see that? So that's how you go converting an Excel file to PDF. You cannot send this as an email to your client, uh, listing the uh, amount and description of a um, service you are rendering, right? So that's how you convert uh, an Excel to a PDF. I believe this has added value to you. If it has, please don't hesitate to share, like, and send your feedback. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click on the link below and click on that subscribe button right on the YouTube. You're watching it on right now. And I will hope to bring you more value tip in our subsequent lesson. Remember to stay safe and see you in the next lesson. Bye for now.